hello friends welcome to my youtube channel technet guide friends in this video i am going to tell you how to configure ha in palo alto firewall high availability active passive ha in palo alto firewall so friends you can see this is my topology where this is my palo alto firewall 1 okay and palo alto firewall 2 so we will configure ha with these two firewall where primary palo alto firewall 1 will be in active state and palo alto 2 will be in passive state okay in ha if firewall 1 will be down then firewall 2 will be in active state okay so initially traffic passing through the firewall 1 when the firewall 1 goes down then traffic will be passing through the secondary firewall okay so that's a benefit of the HA. So here you can see this is my topology here on Palo Alto Firewall 1. This is my LAN zone and this is my subnet here on LAN zone 10.1.1.0. And in outside internet zone, we have subnet 20.1.1.1. So friend, firewall interface IP will be outside IP will be ETH 1 slash 2 20.1.1.1 and LAN side and LAN side ETH 1 slash 1 10.1.1.1 if firewall 1 goes down so this IP will be shifted to firewall 2 ok then communication will be started from firewall 2 here ok so friend to configure firewall in HA we should have control link and data link HA1 is a control link and HA2 is known as data link so what is control link and data link so let me tell you what is control link and data link h1 link h1 is a control link okay it's a control link it's sending hardware that it will say yes i am alive i am alive here it send hardware and the routing information to the secondary one okay and h2 h2 is a data link that will send session table and net table encryption essay IPsec SA to the secondary one if primary firewall will down all session so, so secondary firewall should have all the session so traffic will not drop to here okay return traffic will not drop if we have a session okay so friend let's configure HA in the first firewall one okay then on firewall two will configure only HA then it will sync all the configuration from the firewall one okay so friends you can see this is my firewall 1 and its management ip 100.101 and firewall 2 its management ip 100.201 okay so we'll configure ha first we'll configure ha in firewall 1 here okay now first we'll go to the interface and we'll configure two interface in ha okay we'll configure 1 slash 3 and 1 slash 4 will make as a ha okay so one slash three will be ha interface okay dot control link ha1 okay control link and one way four will be ha interface and it's a comment ha2 okay ha2 okay so we have assigned these two interface in ha so let's first create ip address on this so it is one slash ip address will be this l3 interface l3 10.1.1.1 slash 24 and management profile virtual router will be default zone will be lan and ets2 will be layer 3 interface okay which which is going to outside ip address 20.1.1.1 okay Slash 24 zone will be virtual router default zone will be outside okay now let's con h a here go to the device and you can see high availability so first we have to enable h a here just click here gear button edit and enable h a group id we should have group id so both firewall group id should be same so group id 10 
okay active passive will select here active passive you want to select active to then you can select active to no so enable config sync will be enable config sync here okay so here you will assign h1 peer ip so peer ip h1 will be 1.1.1.2 and peer ip h2 will be 2.2.2.2 okay so 1.1.1.2 and backup so we don't have any backup now click on ok now configure here active passive setting so you can see hold down timer one minute suppose your firewall one goes down so this firewall will wait for one minute for failover okay if within one minute this firewall came up then failover will not happen okay now device priority here will change your device priority so lowest device priority will be the active one okay will be active firewall so we'll keep low, uh, this priority 50 and primson suppose firewall one goes down and secondary become active so when firewall one came up so if primson enable it will be become active so firewall one will be become active recommended setting okay now friends we have to select ha communication in ha communication the communication we will define control link control link will be your one slash three is my ha so ip address one slash three ip address is 1.1.1 netmask dot zero gateway there is no gateway if there is a router in between then you can select here and then gateway will be required okay now click on okay now ha2 link ha2 will be select port 1 slash 4 will be ha2 now its ip address is 2.2.2.1 mask 255.255.255.0 no gateway so ha2 keep live not going to select click ok now link path and monitoring so friend uh, you can configure link path for monitoring suppose this link goes down okay suppose this link go down we will this will be failover okay so path monitoring will be if this path this path here it, it will be down this switch then failover will happen here okay so now we have configure ha okay now click on commit now friends we we have committed here let's see dashboard okay in dashboard we'll add ha part widget system we'll add ha high quality so you can see we have configured active passive local is active and peer unknown because we secondary we are not created it okay so ha2 is up because it's a data link that's why it's it's up okay now go to the secondary firewall so secondary firewall let's go to the interface first we'll move interface in the ha mode okay interface will be h type ha okay this interface type will be ha okay we are not going to configure eth ethernet 1 slash 1 ethernet 1 slash 2 ip addresses because it will sync up the configuration from the primary firewall okay so we'll see okay not going to configure now let's go to the device and ha high quality so first we'll enable ha okay group id should be 10 as we have configured on primary active passive enable config sync now peer ha ip address will be 1.1.1.1 okay parallel 2 peer ip will be 1.1.1 .1 .1, okay click on okay so passive you can see hold down to the same and device priority so in firewall one we have a 
priority is 50 and this one will be 100 so this so this firewall will be passive mode okay now as a profile no need to configure go to the ha communication so ha1 ha1 will be my 1 slash 3 ip address for ha1 1.1.1.2 .1 .1 .2. okay slash 24 so no any gateway in between okay now click on okay now it's a 2 ha2 port will be 1 by 4 ip address 2.2.2.2 net mask 0 transport mode okay ethernet now path monitoring is enable link monitoring enable now commit here now friends we have configured ha okay let's go to general now go to the dashboard we'll add ha widget system HA. Now, friends, you can see local is passive. Okay, local is passive and peer is active firewall. Okay, you can see local is active and peer unknown. Let's refresh it. Okay, now you can see peer 201 is passive. Okay, this one is passive, this one is active. active okay, so all uh, link is up here. Okay, config not synced. We have to manual sync the config first time so you can see there is no config let me show you there is no config on the interfaces so you can see it's still configuration not sync okay but let's check if we able to ping here okay ping 8.8.8.8 now you can see able to ping okay but configuration not sync here let's we sync the config now we can click here to sync to peer okay synchronization is in progress so now you can see synchronized all the configuration let's re refresh here so you can see configuration synchronized okay so it's down state because it's a passive okay now let's start ping here so you can see local is active and this is passive and here you can see local is passive and peer is active okay so let's do one thing friends down this firewall let me stop this firewall and we'll see traffic so let's see secondary one so you can see this is become active okay so let's see the traffic now now you can see traffic is passing through secondary one okay so means our ha is working fine so let's up this firewall here again let's up here move it to start now friends you can see firewall uh, primary firewall came up okay but you can see still local is active secondary firewall is active because we have print not enabled okay print is not enabled that's why it's showing active here okay so let me check the primary one so you can see this is my primary firewall okay and it's, it's still passive okay and secondary become active because print not enabled that's why it's not cam as a active okay so now we will suspend this device okay let's do let's go to the device ha then go to the operation command then suspend local device for high quality we'll suspend here okay now primary will become active okay so let's go to the primary and dashboard now you can see this is become active now secondary one is suspended now we'll do one thing again make local device functional high quality it will be functional then refresh it now you can see secondary become secondary become passive okay how so friends in this video we have seen how to configure ha in palo alto firewall so 
थैंक्स फॉर वाचिंग दिस वीडियो हैव अ नाइस डे